Hey, 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 ladies and gentlemen. You got your girl Sabrina right here. I'm going to get this Facebook time to do his thing. But how many people feel like, Lord, I believe, but help my unbelief. Mm. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, Tawana, how are you? These flies out here early in the morning. Hey, hey, hey. Like and share this video. Hello, Julie. How are you? Like and share this video. Good morning, Jamila. Good morning, Kimmeth. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How many of you know you believe, but it's you like, God, just help my unbelief? Cause, because sometimes it looks like what you want to happen is not happening for you. Right? Right? When you're, you you know what you want, but the, the results that you see with your physical eyes. Good morning, Teresa. You just, it just don't seem like it's happening, right? So you believe because you know that God is a provider. He's a way maker. He's a promise keeper, right? We know the Bible. We know that we should decree a thing. And hi, um, Yonetta. We know that um, we can speak a thing. And we know that, you know, we can walk by faith and not by sight. We know that, you know, faith without works is dead, right? We know all of that, right? We can quote those scriptures, right? We help out in the church, we on the Ursha board. We in the choir, right? You doing all of that. You even at you at Bible study. You at Sunday school. You there on Sunday. Some of them bit me, right? So you believe because you doing some stuff, right? You doing some stuff, but when you go to bed at night, you crying. You like Lord, I just don't. See, I'm I'm working hard. I just don't see how it's gonna happen for me. I don't see how I'm gonna open up this business. I don't see how I'm gonna keep running this house. I don't see how I'm gonna keep this job or keep this car. I don't see it. I don't see how I'm gonna take care of all these damn kids. Right? <laughs> I don't see it. Right? So you, you're saying all of these things, right? So you just can't seem to manifest the life that you know that you deserve. You know that God told you that you can have life and have life more abundantly. Right? Yes or yes. Come on, y'all. Give me some yes or yes. Yes or yes. Yes or yes. We know these things. But nothing is happening. No change is taking place. I'm watching YouTube videos. Um, I'm praying every day. I'm helping the needy. I'm, I'm giving to the homeless. But nothing's happening, right? It's because we were taught to go by what we can see, hear, smell, taste. We were taught by our six senses. We were taught by our six sisters, and so we don't take the time out to use our imagination anymore. These are the higher faculties. We don't take the time out to use our imagination. We are, Well, you know what? I'm going to stop that. We do take the time out to use our imagination. We just imagine the worst. Think about when your kids are gone and they not, or they're not answering the phone. Think about when you call somebody and they don't answer the phone. Your mind immediately, your imagination immediately goes to, is this person in jail? Is this person dead? Right? But we say we believe in God, right? We say we believe. So, Lord, help our unbelief. 
Because we use our imagination, but we use it the wrong way. So if things are not going on in your life the way that you want them to go, guys, it's not with your eyes, your physical eyes that you need to look through them on. Look through your look through it through your imagination. Right? Look through it with your imagination. Imagine how life would be if you had the right good credit, if you had the right marriage, a better marriage, if your kids were better, if your husband was better, if your job was better. Imagine what it would look like. Good morning, Sharon. Write it down. Because all day long, you replaying the bill that you can't pay. Oh, my God, I can't pay this bill. Oh, my God, my rent due, my mortgage due. Oh, my God, my car note due. Oh, my God, I don't know how I'm going to take care of this. I don't know how I'm going to do this. I don't know how I'm going to do that. All day long, you are imagining you don't know how to do it. But what if there was a way? What if you could use your imagination and see the thing already done? What if? Because you can, friends. Because you can. Good morning, Tracy. Like and share this video, guys. Like and share this video. Because you can. Start a watch party on your page. Because you can. You can use your imagination and imagine something the way that you wish it would be. You wish it was. Really, it where it is now, because if you can see it in your mind, it won't be long before it appears in your life. And so, guys, I need you guys to look at it from a different perspective. It's another one of your higher faculties. And I want to talk about all of these higher faculties that I'm giving you today deeper in my Unlock Your Manifestation course, Master Class. We're going to talk about the six higher faculties we want to talk about what they are and how to use them to manifest your dreams because i believe that you believe in god i believe that you believe it's a higher power i believe that you are using your higher faculties but you're just not using them in the right way you're not using your imagination the right way you're not using your perspective the right way. You're not using your will the right way. You're not using visualization the right way. You're not using your memory the right way. These six higher faculties God gave you. He gave them to you for free. He knew that you would need them. You're not using your intuition the right way. Oh my God, you definitely not using your intuition the right way. Because your intuition is what's going to take you to another level. We don't use our intuition. Because once again, if it don't look right, it ain't right. But your intuition is one with God. So it may not look right. It may not look right. Good morning, Ashley. But your higher self knows. Your higher self knows. You see them flies out here. Your higher self knows what's best for you. And so it may not look right. It may not feel right. It may not sound right. None of that. But universal mind, infinite intelligent knows. Good morning. And so I'm going to dive deep into these six faculties because once you learn how to use your imagination once you learn how to use your will once you learn how to use your intuition once you learn how to use your memory once you learn how to use visualization you will see good morning paper girl i don't know why this phone doing this you will see the other side. You will, you will be able to do, be, and have your heart's desire. 
And so we're going to talk about these in my Unlock Your Manifestation Masterclass, July 28th. July 28th. So I need you guys to go to www.unlockyourmanifestations.com. www.unlockyourmanifestations.com. You need to be in this masterclass because you know what to do. You know what to do. You've watched videos. You've, you've watched me do lives. Some of you have taken my Manifest the Dream course. You know what to do. Some of you are on my team and my econ. You know what to do. But you're just not doing it. Why? Why aren't you doing it? And so I want to help you understand why you're not doing what you know you need to be doing. I want to help you understand why you're not doing it. You're not doing it because you haven't understood how to use your imagination properly. You haven't learned how to use your will properly. You haven't learned how to use your intuition properly. You haven't you learned how to use your memory properly. And so that's a it's a skill that you got to develop because you don't use it all the time. You become so human that you allow people and things to dictate where you're going in life. You allow people and things to dictate how you pay your bills. You allow people and things to dictate how you where you go to travel. Thank you so much, girl. Thank you. It's time out for that, guys. It's time for you to create the life that you know that you deserve. You are the creator of your destiny. You, This is your movie. This, this, What's going on right now? This is your movie. You are the star in your own movie. But you keep playing the extra. You allow everybody else to be the star in your movie. Everybody else... Being, you are glorifying and you are cheerleading for them. What about you? What about you? I hope you guys have started a watch party. I hope you guys has liked and shared this video because people need to know why. People going to church every single day. They praying. They paying their tithes. That's right. Co-creating with the universe all the time. Once you become one with the universe... You can do be and have your heart's desire. You got enough word in you. You got enough of that. I believe you have enough of it. I believe that you pray enough. I believe it. Are you praying effectively? Are you praying effectively? The word of God told us to when we speak a thing, when we pray, we should come to come in thanksgiving. Not only should we come in thanksgiving, we should come with belief that it's already done. We should come in belief that it's already done. So some of y'all ain't even praying properly. You ain't going to God as it's already done. You're going to God as you're begging, Lord, please make this happen. Lord, please make... God ain't got to make nothing happen for you, baby. The fact that you can think of it, the fact that you can speak on it, it's already done. You have to touch and agree with God. You got to touch and agree with God. It's already done. It's already done. I have given you life. Given you means he already gave it to you. And giving you life more abundantly. So anything that you can think or even ask for, it's already done. So you have to learn how to go to God as it's already done. You got to touch. That's right, Tiffany. Touch and agree with God. It's already done for you. It's already done for you. That millionaire you want to be, that house you want to buy, that shelter you want to build, that business you want to create. It's already done for you. You have to use your six higher faculties to pull it down out of spiritual realm. Because it's already done. 
It's already done. It's already been created in the spiritual realm for you. God already created for you. It's, it's, it's already here. You got to learn how to pull it down. The word of God says to cast down all imaginations. The word of God is to cast down all imagination. It's time for you to bring it down. Cast those things out of your mind that's making you believe that it's not going to happen for you. Cast down those things. So I want to show you how to use your imagination properly in my Unlock Your Manifestations. Because what you want to manifest is already here. That's why it's called manifest. Because it's here already. You just want to manifest it so where you can see it. And it's a way you got to use your imagination. It's a way you got to use your intuition. It's a way you got to use your will. It's a way you got to use your memory. It's a way that you have to use your perspective that'll pull that thing down to you. It's going to pull it right to you and you're going to have direct access to it all. You're going to have direct access to it all, friends. All right. So you need to go to www.unlockyourmanifestations.com. I'm super excited about this, guys. I've been spending a lot of time with God and meditating. That's why I'm sitting outside right here. I've been sitting out here meditating and praying and, and just thanking God for the abundance. For the yes that he's already given me. For the love that he's already given me. For the abundance that he's already given me. I just been out here being grateful and showing my gratitude. So guys, go to www.unlockyourmanifestations. It's time for you to believe bigger. To dream bigger. To learn how to use these six faculties. Stop being so human and come a co-creator with God. Stop being so human. You are a spiritual being having a human experience. Your spirit is supposed to be so strong and so powerful that it overtakes your physical body and you able to do some supernatural things with your life. That's the way it's supposed to be. The spirit man is supposed to be so powerful on the inside of you that you can go out here and take some miraculous action and people look at you and say, Woo, who's that girl? Who's that boy? What anointing do they have on their life? They making some sh things shake and move. Who is that girl? Who is that boy? And that's the God that's on the inside of you. That'll be that spirit that God said can do greater things that he could do. Greater is he that is in you. You supposed to be that spirit that's on the end that lives on the inside of you. Supposed to magnify this physical body that you are in. And you supposed to be out here doing opening up some miraculous business, some supernatural businesses. You supposed to be out here helping these young men and these young women. You supposed to be out here opening up shelters and banks and and grocery stores and in, in, in gas stations. You're supposed to be building subdivisions and apartment homes. Schools. You have the power to do that, friends. You have the power to do that. You just got to unlock it. All right? Unlock it. And so I need you guys to like and share this video. Start a watch party on your page. Get people to this information. Get people to this information because it's going to be some supernatural things happen. The last six months of this year. Real five months, really. So supernatural things are going to happen. And I'm going to help you believe. I'm going to help you use your imagination. I'm going to help you use your will. I'm going to help you use your perspective. Use your memory. Use your intuition. That intuition got to be tapped into, baby. That intuition got to be tapped into because you, you don't use it. 
you don't use it for real, for real. But we're going to dive deep into that intuition. I can't wait to dive in real deep with this intuition because we got it and we don't use it. You listen to it and then you brush it off. You don't act on it. Your intuition tell you, don't do that, you still do it. Your intuition tell you to go that way, you still go another way. Your intuition tell you something funny about this person, but you still talk to them, you still go around them. Because you haven't developed your intuition. You keep questioning what God gave you, that's your GPS. You keep questioning it. You keep questioning it. Your intuition is the highest faculty that God has given you. That you ain't, they ain't got to open their mouth. You, know, you can read all about them. But you're not using it properly, guys. You got a will that you can do something. You can give yourself a command. You can give yourself a command and say, go do this and go do that. And, and if you do it with the spirit that told you to do it, It'll happen so fast for you. It'll be so much power on that thing that people will be like, what the hell just happened? But you don't move when you got the power. You don't move with your will when you know you're supposed to be doing something. I'm tired. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll do it next week. I'll do it on Monday. I'll do it. I don't know when I'll do it. And by the time you get to it, ain't no power behind it. It ain't going to move nothing. You allowed the power, the energy to die down. Because you didn't do it with the inspired action. You didn't do it with the willpower that God gave you. You did it when you felt like it. You didn't do it when your intuition told you to do it. So when you decided to do it, nothing happened. Nothing moved. Nothing shifted. We're going to unlock those manifestations on July 28th. We're going to unlock them. And after I finish with you, your life will never be the same. You're going to be able to manifest like a pro. You're going to become a co-creator with God. You're going to become one with the universe. You're going to learn how to become one with the universe. Because when you become one, with source, with God, with the all-knowing, with the all-power, with the infinite. You can do, be, and have your heart's desire. You can earn more money. You can become healthier. You can have more freedom. And that's what it's about, guys. That is what it's about. That is why you, you, you came in this body to experience human form. Don't get so caught up in the shell. That's right, Rashina. You've been around me enough. You should learn to move. And when when the intuition tell you to move, you can't say, I don't have money. I don't know nobody. I don't have no car. I don't, I don't, I don't know how I'm going to do that. It don't matter how you're going to do it. Take the next big step. When you take the next best step, All the rest of it going to come, guys. And so I can't wait to July 28th. Go to www.unlockyourmanifestations.com right now. Somebody type in the comment box for me. www.unlockyourmanifestations.com. Go to that website right now. Go right now. Go right now. Go right now. Somebody type it. Type it for me, Rashina. Type it, type it, type it. Go there right now. Get in limited seats because it's a free master class. So it's limited seats. Thank you, Tiffany. It's limited seats. So I, I'm sorry. I, I have, I'm invested enough by telling y'all this free information. <laughs> I couldn't, I'm not going to be buying a thousand seats. So I bought a, about 50 seats. So 50 people, that's it. So get on the call early. Go ahead and register. 
once you max it out, the call is maxed out, you got to watch for the replay. But if you're on that email list, you're going to get the replay. And then you can watch it from there, okay? But make sure you are in. Get your mama on. Get your daddy on. Get all, especially get all your church going folks on. Because they've been going, they've been doing too much church already. It's time for them to take action. They've been reading the Bible. They've been in the choir. They've been helping the homeless. They usher. They do everything inside the church, but they don't have no money. And they can't create, they, they don't have no good marriages. They children bad as hell. And I want to help you shift that. All right? I want to help you shift that. So go to that website that's in the comment box. Unlock your manifestations. Get everybody you know on. Like and share this video. Even if you just watch this video and do what I said in this video, you could manifest your dreams. But if you want to dive deeper and you want to know some exact steps on how to use your imagination, how to use your intuition, how to use your will, how to use your memory, how to use your perspective, how to use it. If you want some steps on how to use these things, because that's how you manifest. You're not manifesting anything in your physical body. You're manifesting for those six things I just named. You're just not using them properly. But when you learn to use them properly, when you learn to tap into all-knowing, infinite energy, you can win, guys. You can win. You can win. And you deserve to win. All right? So like and share this video. Click that link in the comment box. If you got some value from this live, give me some fire in the comment box. If you're watching the replay, click replay. But if you're watching me right now, give me some fire. Go to my Instagram, y'all. Go to my Instagram. I need all y'all to go to my Instagram right now. Um, underscore Sabrina Wright. Underscore Sabrina Wright. In the comment box, say I'm ready. Under the master class. Go to my IG right now, y'all. Please, all four y'all, all five y'all. Go to my IG, underscore Sabrina Wright. And say I'm ready. Up under the post about the master class. Say I'm ready. Let's get some momentum going. Let's share this information. I'm excited to see these breakthroughs. I'm excited to see new houses, new cars, new relationships, children being saved, boys being saved. When I mean saved, meaning we got programs out there that's giving back. We got other things going on because we keep we, these children need us. But if we don't help if help ourselves, we can't help nobody else we got these big dreams and big goals of and how we're gonna give back to charity and all these things we're gonna do when we get the money it's time to manifest the money it's time to because it's already here the money the help the resources is already here friends you gotta unlock it so you can manifest your dreams all right so you deserve to win go to my ig click the link in the in the comment box and i can't wait to see you guys bye bye now